The education system in Gaza has been decimated. 625,000 children are being denied the right to education amidst this carnage, where over 40,000 innocent civilians have been killed, half of them children, school-age children and adolescents. And now it has also spread to the West Bank. We cannot continue like this. Yes, I condemn the hostage taking, a violation of international humanitarian law. I also condemn the crimes against humanity at the minimum that are currently being committed in Gaza as we speak. I have never in my lifetime seen such brutality, such inhumanity, such lack of empathy, such disrespect for international law as I see in Gaza today. We have a world order, it exists. We don't need a new one, but we need to revive the world order that was created in 1945. The United Nations, the UN Charter, the Universal Declaration for Human Rights that commits the same rights and protection for all people of the world, including the Palestinian people in Gaza and the West Bank. And world leaders need to act with responsibility, empathy, maturity, and most of all, in accordance with international law. That's why you are a chosen leader, to help us reach our humanity and not go the other way. We stand at the crossroads. The time to choose humanity is now. Thank you.